I'm the Drone Girl. I am here underneath the San Francisco Bay checking out the new Power Ray drone. This is actually an underwater drone and it is one of the first devices I've seen where you look at the word UAV and the A actually stands for aquatic. We've got an underwater aquatic vehicle right here. Let's go check it out. Much like how photographers use drones to get a new aerial perspective, this drone could be a game changer in getting a new underwater perspective. Photographers might want to use it to photograph underwater worlds. Scientists might use it to conduct research in real time without having to go underwater themselves. And fishermen might use it to detect where the fish are. I've got uh, inquiries from researchers from the boating club for the recreational use user. They all want to do different kinds of things because uh, this is the first obvious kind to combine boat, filming, imaging capabilities as well as the fish finding capabilities. So they can just, they just need one device to do that. We have emerged from down below and are back on land with our trusty drone in hand. This thing is actually pretty heavy, it's 7.7 .7 pounds, so more than you would really expect from a traditional aerial vehicle. This thing can swim for up to four hours and it can dive as deep as 100 feet. One thing you'll notice is it's got a camera on here, it shoots 4K video, which is really, really high quality footage for you to take some really awesome underwater shots. The drone's price starts at $1,488. The whole thing is controlled with an RC transmitter. Much like how the left stick controls altitude on an aerial drone, the left stick here controls the depth of the drone in the water. The right stick controls the direction that the drone swims. A mobile app allows you to live stream what the drone sees directly through your smartphone or tablet. The app also allows users to adjust camera settings. 95% of the ocean is still unexplored and the Power Ray could make a real contribution in changing that with real applications that truly could revolutionize photography and science. 